Hey friends, have you ever been watching a YouTube video and wish that you could have your ad appear on that channel? Well, I have some good news and some bad news for you. The good news is that you still can, but the bad news is that ability is going away in the summer of 2023. In this short video, I'm gonna show you how you can run an ad on the YouTube video or channel of your choice. It's really easy to do and you'll have some peace of mind knowing that you're not wasting money running ads on irrelevant YouTube videos. And if you're looking for more tips to drive results for your business, I have something that I want to give you, and that's my seven-day online marketing jumpstart PDF. You can get it at scottredgate.com slash jumpstart. If you're looking for simple tips that can get your business results, this is a great document. It's completely free. It's quick. It's simple bullets. And after you complete the steps outlined in this doc, not only will your website have a solid foundation to generate more leads or get more revenue, but you'll have a lot more confidence that you can manage your own digital marketing campaigns without hiring an agency. All right, let's dive in. If you're new to this channel, my name is Scott Redgate and I'm passionate about helping small businesses make more and spend less and show you that you have what it takes to manage your own online marketing campaigns. All right, so we're in the dashboard for Google Ads and we're gonna go into campaigns and select create new campaign. So now you're greeted with the screen that says, what is your campaign's objective? The one that we're gonna select is create a campaign without a goals guidance. And then it brings up the different campaign types that we can choose from. So there's search, performance max, others, and we're going to select video. And then we're going to select a campaign subtype. And so right now what we're going to select is create a custom video campaign, customize your own settings with skippable in-stream ads. Now that that has loaded, we're now at the general settings of the campaign where you can name this campaign whatever you want. What I'm gonna type in here is YouTube channel placement. And then as far as bid strategy, you can select maximum CPV or target CPM. For the purpose of this video, um, you can choose whatever you would like. And then you can select your campaign budget and then the dates that you would like for it to start and end. If you don't have any end date in mind, you can just leave that blank. And now we're at the network screen. This ad is simply gonna appear before the video of your choosing, so you really don't need to worry about this selection because the only placements that we're gonna select is the video or channel of your choice. We're gonna scroll past the location and languages section, and now you can name your ad group. I'm gonna call it YouTube channel placement. And now this is the main section that I wanted us to get to. So what we're gonna select, we're not gonna select keywords or topics. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go into this placements option. And what we're gonna do is in this section, you can simply copy and paste the URL of the YouTube video that you wanna appear on or the YouTube channel that you want to appear on. And then it will actually populate the videos of that channel. So what I'm gonna do here is paste in a channel of uh, digital marketer Neil Patel and I wanna show you what this looks like. So I have the option to select all of his channel or I can select specific videos to have my video ad run before his videos. So I'm gonna select Neil Patel, and now you can go in and upload and create your video ad so that it appears on the Neil Patel video or videos that you want. I know we breezed past the ad creation in the bid setting for this campaign, but you're gonna to wanna to take your time so that you can get the best results possible so that you have a really strong ad and you have a solid bid, and then your ad will appear before the channel or the video of your choice. And then you simply click Create Campaign and there's a short approval process, and then you should start to see your ad appear before the channel or video that you chose. One quick caveat to mention is that businesses and YouTubers do have the ability to exclude certain people or certain users from advertising on their channel. And so if you're trying to advertise on a direct competitor's YouTube channel and you're not seeing any impressions after you followed these steps, there is a chance that they have you listed as an exclusion so that you won't be able to advertise on their channel. I hope those insights were helpful for you. And if you're looking for more money-saving marketing advice, visit scottredgate.com and subscribe to this channel to watch more content. Thank you so much for watching this video. Take care.